Hello there folks, what we will be doing today is performing a reset of the expiration base of an ESXi that we will be using for testing. If we don't have a valid license, what we could do is, upon the completion of the installation of the ESXi testing host, we could back up the file called license.cfg. So what we could usually do is, connect to it by SSH and then using WinSCP we could practically back up the file. In order for us to back up the file, we have to enable the SSH service of the ESXi host. Once we have enabled the SSH uh, service of the ESXi host, we could connect to it using WinSCP and back up the file called license.cfg which is located under the etc slash vmware folder. As you can see, I just practically dragged the license at CFG to a folder in my desktop. After we have backed up the file, we could now disable the SSH service since we no longer use it. no longer need to use it again unless we need to import the backup license at CFG, which we will be showing in the video later on. As we can see, the expiration days of the SXI host is now 52 days. So what we're going to be doing is to restore the 60-day trial period again. For us to do this, we have to enable the SSH service again, and then connect to it via WinSCP, and then re-import the license that CFG that we have backed up before in the earlier part of this video. Override the existing file with the backup file. After we have re imported the license to CFG, we could just do a refresh. And as soon as we do the refresh, you will notice that the 52 days that was showing earlier is now showing us 60 days again. Just like that, we were able to restore it to a 60 day trial period. If you do find the topic helpful, do not hesitate to show us your love. Smash the subscribe button, click on the bell icon, have a good one folks.